I honestly believe that there was a huge amount of naivety surrounded the playing of the game 48 hours after all those people lost their lives. We used to have one football team that represented the whole island, just like in rugby. But even before the country divided, football did. I mean, we were all glad that the game was played and played in Belfast. I think everybody felt that sport should win and football should win over the Troubles. There was parties in uh, the Falls Road, the Shagel Road, all the different parts of Belfast celebrating. Everybody was celebrating down in Dublin. We thought we've unified the country. The team was called Shamrock Rovers 11. Because the IFA were against it, and even my old, old pal Liam Tui would have told me that the FAI weren't too, too enamoured by the whole thing either because they weren't running the show. It is a really good experience now, watching Northern Ireland play football. And there's one slight issue still left to go, and that is the anthem. Why can't we get our own anthem? No matter where you go, nothing brings a home to you like standing for the National Anthem. Suddenly, uh, you've got the country dependent on you. I didn't even know any Protestants because I grew, I grew up in, in West Belfast and went to a Catholic school, and uh, you never got the opportunity. But then when I started playing um, football when I was 16, 17, you started playing different teams and different teams from other schools. It's almost 100 years since football fractured. Can that split be healed? Can football in Ireland overcome a century of division?